Alex Pereira knocked out Yuri Prohaska for the second time now. This time it was in the second round and it was from a head kick. Yuri had previously been dropped at the end of the first round and at that point I honestly thought it was going to be over. I thought that the ref was going to stop it then. Um, I think Yuri even thought maybe <laughs> that the ref was going to stop it. And then going into the second round, I knew that he probably wasn't going to be able to recover in time before he got hit with another big shot. So I hope that people aren't overly critical of Yuri Prohaska because while, of course, there are improvements that he can make with his defense, I think that we're asking a lot from Yuri at this point in his career to completely change the way that he fights. I think is a big ask. So he mentioned moving down to middleweight is an idea, and I think that suits him very well. I think there are better matchups for him at middleweight. I think Yuri Prohaska versus Robert Whitaker would be an interesting fight. Even Yuri Prohaska versus Sean Strickland, I honestly don't hate. It seems kind of awkward, but I actually think it that might be a good fight. And then also Yuri Prohaska versus Hamzat, of course, that would be a huge fight. I think that Drakus Duplessis or Israel Adesanya are interesting matchups for Yuri. I think Yuri Prohaska should move down to middleweight. If he can make the weight, I don't see why not. I think there are some really interesting matchups for him down at 185. I think him versus Robert Whitaker is the fight to make. If he moves down to 185, I mean, they're both former champions in their divisions so i think you make robert whitaker versus yuri prohaska as a title eliminator at 185 because for whatever reason it seems like they don't want sean strickland to fight for a title even though he probably should um but i do like the idea of yuri making a run at the 185 title that to me is very interesting because then he could be fighting either israel adesanya or drakis duplessis and both of those to me are very interesting matchups so i really like the idea of yuri moving down to 185 and then let's say he does fight robert whitaker let's say he wins and then let's say he fights i don't know i think israel adesanya is gonna beat drakis personally but I don't know, I'm kind of 50-50 on it, to be honest. Um, I think that Yuri versus Israel Adesanya is a very interesting fight as well. Then he can move right back up to light heavyweight and depending on who is champion at the time, I doubt it will be Alex Pereira. I, I think Alex will be moved on to bigger and better things. 